morning, hello again, thanks for tuning in. So it's a cold February morning and we're doing a bit of pike fishing on the Trent. Uh, the rivers are up a little bit, we've had some rain, um, it's bitterly cold, howling gale. Will we catch anything? I don't know. But uh, when I do predator fishing in the winter on the Trent, I generally only come for a couple of hours, try one or two swims, and if they're not feeding, they're not feeding. We'll, but it gets out the ass for a little bit. Uh, but anyway, today we're fishing with lamprey. I've got one rod set up on a paternoster rig, so we'll have a look at the rig later on. Um, but we'll see if we can catch anything first. So I'm looking for pike. Ideally, I want double figure pike, but any pike I'd take <laughs> in this sort of weather or any sort of predator. Um, you get Xander, Xander as well, but uh, they're few and far between. I mean, a realistically, pike between five and ten pounds is probably uh, that's the most, yeah, most chance of catching something else, probably in that sort of category. But you never know, anything can turn up on these sessions. Uh, but uh, so I'm fishing with a bit of lamprey today and uh, we'll see if we catch anything. Speak in a bit. Fingers crossed. We're in. Oh, double trebles, semi barbless on. So I can strike pretty straight away. Wow, it's a chub. Can you believe it? It's a chub, took the lamprey. Amazing. <laughs> well, that's the first for me. It's a big job as well. Wow, that is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Got it. As easy as that. Let this fish rest and we'll have a look at him.
So look at him. So we've weighed him, four pound ten ounce. A pristine River Trent chub. There's not a mark on this fish. Don't like it's ever been caught. It probably only eats other fish. Look how thick it is across the back. Four pound ten and a big belly on it. Really big girth. Huge tail fin. Let's turn it around and look at the other side. It's it looks scale perfect. And look how fat, fat the belly is from eating fish. What a stunning creature that is. Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I think that's one of my best ever looking chub that is. Not quite my biggest, but wow. To catch it on the lamprey as well. Amazing. Must have been hungry. <laughs> Let's put him back. see him go. What a stunning fish that is. Absolutely awesome. Let's see him go. And away he goes. Well, that's not bad for a cold February morning, is it? <laughs> Back with the same lamprey on. Oh, that wind's going up now. Absolutely howling. So my rig then today for piking with, or chubbing with, <laughs> is a Drennan slider pike float. That's got a stop knotted, but at about eight foot height. Goes down to two weights with a trace on. And then the weight is a four ounce weight I've got on the bottom. So it's a pattern knotted star with a trace coming off the side. It's two SSD shot, holding it in position, but they will slide if needs be. And then I've got a, a 40 pound wide trace with two size four trebles, barbless trebles on with my lamprey. And then you see I've got some elastics just to hold it all nice and neat there in position. And that's what they chucked up. Look, well, I think we'll have one more cast. It's getting cold and wet now. It's really windy at the moment. So I'm using these big rod rests. And then I've got a bite alarm in case I nod off. Because I'm not paying attention. Right, that's it. See you later. Four pound ten ounce. We've been caught. It probably only eats other fish. Look how thick it is across the back. Four pound ten and a big belly on it. Really big girth. Huge tail fin.
What a stunning creature that is. Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> awesome.